quite beautiful. What's so special about it? Your brother mm -hmm. can paint something way better no, than this. No, 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 no. Not only better, but it can be even brighter and more vivid. Really? No, no. I... Let's see for ourselves. <sighs> Alas, the problem is how to make a painting brighter and more vivid. If we use highlighter pens and layer them, mm -hmm. it doesn't work. Well, let's try the dye from glow sticks. Doesn't work mm -hmm. either. Is there a material that's inherently brighter and more vivid than fluorescent dye? Hey, actually there is! Look, we're talking about the quantum dot material. Huh? Quantum dots? Can this thing be brighter than highlighter pens? Yes, it's brighter than regular fluorescent pigment with more pure and vivid colors. It looks pale! You can't tell right now, but once you turn off the light and shine ultraviolet light on it... Oh, that's bright! See? It's said to be an ideal luminous material and even won the Nobel Prize in Chemistry in 2023. It has great potential in fields like fluorescent labeling and display technology. Ooh. With it, I could paint my sister a glowing masterpiece. First, we extract the line art using software and then print it out. Next, we start coloring. By the way, you said they're quantum dots. Anything to do with quantum theory? The teacher mentioned this luminescence is related to the quantum confinement effect in quantum theory. You lost me there. <laughs> to put it simply, when semiconductor particles shrink to the nanoscale, quantum confinement occurs. This makes the nanoparticles emit light when exposed to light or current, and the light's color varies depending on the particle size. So, by controlling the size of the quantum dots, we get different colors of light. It has another feature, high brightness, pure color, and a wide coloring. Oh. All right, it's done. Next, we just need to frame it. And we're finished. It just looks like a regular colored turtle drum. Don't worry. Once we turn on the black light, we'll see.